Good afternoon, this is Dave with the uh, Sunday edition of the Daily Blooms from the Rochester, Genesee Region Orchid Society show and sale. This is the last day. Um, looks like they've had a very good turnout here. Um, this is my plant that I had entered. Um, it's opened up a lot more now than it was. Um, had it been this open to begin with, I'm sure it would have won first place. As it was when I got back here, I found out I won third place for, I don't know, the species or whatever. Um, for, from, I don't know, it doesn't say exactly on the back what it's from, but, but um, anyway, so I won second overall and uh, third place um, from the bigger ribbon. So, anyway. Um, that's it, it looks great. No, go ahead. <laughs> that's my plant. That's, that's amazing. Plant. I'm like, excuse me. I'm like, I'm so intrigued by it. <laughs> Thank you. So anyway, we'll see what else is looking. Thank you. Thank you. We'll look around and see what else we've got here. Uh, that was somebody that was admiring my plant and taking uh, photos of it while I was trying to video it. So anyway, um, this is uh, Jean Keatings. Uh, she is the president of the uh, Genesee Region Orchid Society. Uh, a beautiful display. I'm going to try to concentrate more on the displays today than I have in the past. Um, over here is uh, Peter Martin. I don't know who he is. He may be a member of the society. I'm not sure. There's his display. This one is Susan Garo. I think I recognize her name as a member of our society. Beautiful Philanopsis display. Uh, this is Diane Bernard and Carol Butchers, who are members of the Genesee Region Orchid Society. They have a little terrarium over there that's quite nice. Uh, over across the way, we have, uh, let's see, I don't know who this one is. Orchids on the patio, I don't know who that is, but uh, anyway, get a picture of it. Over here is uh, J and L orchids display, which had a very nice assortment of orchids. Um, go around people here so you get a good view of it uh, over here is Kelly Corners they won several awards uh, this Epi Catlia won uh, this Mastivalia which is absolutely beautiful won a few awards um, I know Peter got two Again, with Kelly's Corners. Here's the ribbons they won. Uh, this is a friend of mine on Facebook, Bob Wymans. I knew he was going to have a display here, but I haven't seen him yet. I haven't met the guy personally. Bob, I hope to meet you as we're tearing him down, maybe. He has a beautiful display of Catlias today. Um, I knew he had some coming. We had posted them earlier on Facebook that he had some that were in bloom looking very nice. And that he does. I especially like his red one here. Oh, excuse me. This red one. This red one I think is very beautiful. And of course this one is beautiful also. Um, and he's a Facebook friend of mine. Over here we have Mount Prospects orchids. Um, she always has beautiful orchids on display. You can see. Now this is uh, Marlowe orchids display. They won uh, award for. Uh, 
Let's see, is it uh, its best, most outstanding orchid exhibit? Uh, they always seem to win a win a special special prizes because they always have a beautiful display. As you can see there's a beautiful vanda up there that they have in bloom. We come down across. I'm trying to go slow. I know I go too fast sometimes. Um, Less talking and more looking, maybe. Works better. Got a nice There's a beautiful one right there. And that's Marlowe Orchids. They're local right here in Rochester. Actually, Scottsville. But they have beautiful orchids. They're online. Uh, I buy lots of plants from them. Over here is my friend from uh, Main Street Orchids. Um, by looking around, it, you know, it appears that all the vendors had a very good uh, season of selling stuff here. Uh, a few days, three days. And they are full, the days were full, but um, it appears it's been a very worthwhile sale. Even though they were down a couple vendors this year, um, seemed to be a, a good turnout. People bought a lot of, a lot of plants from the looks. Uh, this is Cloud's Orchids. Uh, he comes from Canada. Mainly has Philanopsis. That's another look at Mount Prospects. And then uh, we'll look here. As you can see, the tables are pretty bare. That's Mount Prospects. This is Clouds. This is uh, Main Street uh, Orchids, which I just bought one. I just bought one here that I had him set back that I think is absolutely gorgeous. Uh, this is a beautiful, mature Catlia mounted in bloom and I was ecstatic to get it um, if that keeps growing and is in bloom next year it'll be in the show for sure it gave me a good deal on that I appreciate it Mike and it looks like he had a good sale uh, he's pretty well emptied out hi how are you doing good that's a member of the orchid society I forget your name, or don't you want to be on the Daily Booms? Oh, John. <laughs> John, this is John. I know he's in the, he's a member. Been, I've been stuck in the potting area. Oh, he's doing I've the potting I've been playing today. In, the, in the charcoal and the bark. You having a good turnout? Yeah. Good. Yeah. Okay. And I managed to sell a lot of books, too. Oh, so, good. Yeah. Because yeah. I weigh them. Oh, all right. Price it by weight. No, well. That's always okay. yeah, Nothing on it. it I'm going to well. price it by weight. So. <laughs> Good talking to you, John. Yeah. It's almost over, huh? Uh, there's the last hurrah. Yeah. The last hurrah. Yeah. But we're about done for today, though. Are we? At four? It's or? almost four now. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah getting close. Yeah. It looks like everybody has sold quite a bit. Yeah, so. it does. Looks yeah. like a very good, very good sale. Yeah. yeah. And still people are buying. Uh, there's still people coming in. And, uh, you know, the Compared to what it was to begin with, it looks like it's pretty well down. Um, I bought several from JNL. Um, they had a lot of bulbophyllums and uh, some beautiful plants. Um, they come from uh, let's see, Connecticut, I think. These guys are from. And uh, that's the younger brother. And this is the older brother here. You can see they have uh, they've sold a lot. They have nice a lot of bulbophyllums and uh, other orchids that they have here for sale, which I have bought a lot of. Um, I wish I could afford to buy more and had more room, but I'm running out of room, so 
you know, I have to kind of cut back a little bit myself. But they certainly have some beautiful, beautiful orchids here. And last but not least is Marlowe's. Uh, there's Mike. And talking to some good people looking to buy things. Uh, there's Jim wrapping things up. Now is the time to wheel and deal and make some some good uh, good buys. And our friends Kelly's Corners is uh, probably looking forward to packing up and heading home. So. There's Jonathan making, or no, that's Victor. That's not Jonathan, that's Victor over there uh, making a sale. And uh, that's probably going to wrap it up for today for the 44th annual um, Genesee, Genesee Regional Orchid Society uh, sale and show. It's been a good year. Uh, look forward to next year. There's Jeannie over there. She's probably about glad to have it over too. They've been going here for like all week. So that'll do it for us today from Rochester Eisenhart Auditorium. Thanks for watching. So long.